There's a Mexican national sitting in the Refugio County Jail on drugs on uh, gun smuggling charges. His bond is set at a half million dollars. Authorities believe he was trying to smuggle guns into Mexico. Our Michael Gibson has the story from Refugio. Authorities say the man was driving this truck, pulling this vehicle back to Mexico, supposedly to resell it. But authorities say they already knew that wasn't true. This trip had nothing to do with reselling vehicles. We try to connect the dots on, on a lot of this stuff. You, you never know what you're going to come up against. The next, uh, we're talking about the intel. Was, it was money. money. It was a money load coming, coming through here. Ended up being guns. Uh. This man, Carlos Gonzalez Mar, is in the Refugio County Jail, charged with possession of four stolen guns and money laundering. His bail is set at $500,000. Authorities say he was the person behind the wheel of this truck towing another vehicle where a total of 10 handguns were discovered hidden inside the transmission and oil pan. Uh, from the time the stop was made, that was probably uh, eight or 10 hours that were uh, taken and, and, and taking this vehicle apart and uh, finally getting to the to the loot, so to speak, uh, the farms. Uh, they had done a real good job of hiding the stuff and uh, uh, we were able to, to find it. An out-of-state tip allowed authorities to track the suspect, and once he was spotted near Refugio, here along Highway 77, he was stopped on a traffic violation. Investigators thought they were going to find a large amount of cash, but instead, they discovered the hidden weapons and about $11,000 in cash. It's believed that the weapons were headed to a Mexican drug cartel and that there is much more to this story as the investigation continues. From Refugio County, Michael Gibson, 3 News.